Okay, so today I'm going to be starting this video a little bit differently to how I normally do. I wanted to start off by saying thank you all so much for the support shown on my Mafia Definitive Edition gameplay trailer reaction video. I don't really know what to say, all I can say is that I uploaded the video late last night, today is the 23rd, and in an hour it had already reached over 100 views, which is baffling to me. I know Mafia content does tend to do better on my channel, but just over 300 views has been the upper limit so far. So to wake up this morning and see over 700 views, and at the time of me recording this, being well over 1,300, I don't know what to say. At the time of me editing this, this is how many views it's on. Thank you once again so much. I really don't know what to say. As well as thanking you all so much for that, I do want to say I now have an Instagram account. The account's been active for about a week, but as of today, there should be some content on there which you may like to take a look at. And if you do, a follow is always greatly appreciated and I will leave links to that down below. Uh, one final thing, and I know in my Mafia Definitive Edition gameplay trailer reaction video, I made a point of stating that I don't like to do this. But if you do go on to enjoy the video, a like is always greatly appreciated. And if you do end up enjoying the content that is here on the channel, please feel free to subscribe as well. Right, so I think I've rambled on for long enough. So today we're going to be continuing the Mafia 2 Definitive Edition. We're going to be picking up from exactly where we left off, so let's just jump straight into it. Right, let's go answer the phone, see what today's got in store for us. Hello? Hello. Yeah, Vito, we got a situation here. Grab a gun and meet me at the bar, and make sure you're driving a decent set of wheels. Will do. Let's get dressed nice first. Today. Uh, let's wear... We wore this suit last time. Let's wear it again. It was nice. I like it. Open up, police! Oh, what the f- Oh wait, no, it's not me. I really thought they were there for me. Right. Here's my car from last time. Let's not drive this car. I, I don't think we need to drive this car today. I think we can pull out our- one What the hell happened to my car? But now we have the funds to fix it. Let's drive our nice little car today. I miss this car. Oh, and I've already put a dent in it. Don't hit the officer! Oh. Right. Let's go see what Mr. Scarp has got for us today. Morning, Eddie. Hey, Vito. I'd like to introduce you to somebody. Vito, this is Carlo Falcone. Pleasure to meet you, Mr. Falcone. Vito? So, Vito. How do you feel about Alberto Clemente and Luco Godino? Well... Honestly, Mr. Falcone, the way I see it, those assholes tried to steal 5,000 bucks from me and then left me in a rotten jail. That's good, because the two of them are planning to make a move on us. So it looks like we're going to have to do something before they do something. Eddie will tell you the rest. I'm sure you won't let me down. Goodbye, Mr. Falcone. Nice to meet you, Vito. So what the hell's going on? A car with three of our guys in it disappeared last night, and word around town is that Luca might have had something to do with it. Who's missing? Harvey Beans and the two guys who were supposed to be protecting him, Tony Balls and Frankie the mm -hmm. Mick. Yeah. Beans is Carlo's accountant. If he talks, we're all fucked. What do you need me to do? I need you to wait for him in front of Freddy's and follow him to find out if he's involved. And then? If you find out that he had anything to do with this, you whack the bastard. And if any of our guys is still alive, try and rescue them. Hopefully you can find them before they spill the beans about our operation. Where do you think he'll go? I got no idea. So go prepared. Make sure you've got a fast car and some firepower. All right, no problem. Okay, stop by here when you're done. And Vito, don't tell nobody about this. Got it. Right. Looks like we're off to whack Luca Greeno. This is Luca's car. Now, where are you, Luca? 
There you are. Okay, here we go. Shouldn't get too close. Oh I god, my sure car. Doesn't see me. Luke is not going to see me. It's not like I stand out in this car. Not at all. Hello, officer. You don't see me either. Because I have not committed any crimes today. Really? I'm coming for you, Luca. Uh, not so fast. Ruski's junkyard, maybe. Mike doesn't get involved in shit like this. Oh, really? I'm having trouble driving today, man. Clementi slaughterhouse, of course. Looks like Eddie was right. Okay. I gotta get in there without being seen. Right. Gotta sneak in. Sneaky, sneaky time, Vito. Soon. Jesus Christ. Maybe that's the way. Don't hurt yourself, I mate. Off. Oh, why did I choose to wear a white oh, suit? Jesus Christ, that reeks. There's, there's a rat over there. Get out of my way, rat. Of all the suits in the game I could have worn, I wore a white suit. I, 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 my problem. brain works on a different level, lads. My brain is just beyond human comprehension. I forget exactly which pipe it is. Every pipe I walk past, I'm like getting scared. I think it's this one. Yeah. <laughs> oh no. My, my beautiful suit. If Luke could just stop by to pick up some sticks, I'm gonna kill somebody. Here we are, a ladder. must admit, I love how the fact that you get covered in shit plays into the mission. Like, you get noticed because of it. It's not just a funny gag 2k pulled. It's pretty cool, I love that. Okay, time to move. Good night, buddy. Oh, I don't know why I thought I could take you down. No, 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 friend. No, no, no. You are not going to see me on this day. Yeah, heard that one before, pal. No, no, no. Right. So, uh, you still thinking about quitting? Yeah, probably next month. Hey, what was that screaming? I forget if they these guys say anything if they see me. I mean, they're not enemies. Becoming a voice actor. But they do. <laughs> they will see something if they see me. They will say something if they see me. Right. Shifts over. You got shit in your ears? I said you're done for today. But I ain't done pounding the beefsteak. Hey, don't make me say it again. 
Can I go through this door? No, it's locked, doesn't it? Yeah, it's locked. Right, buddy. I'm going to have to sneak in over here. Sneaky man. I am one sneaky man. Be right there. Sneaking around. Because I'm the sneakiest man. Think I don't know about the dope. I know where you got the money. Falcone thinks he's got a good racket going. But he ain't going to get away with it. Come on. How'd you get it into the States? I don't know anything. I'm just an accountant. Don't fuck with me, you egghead bastard. You want to end up just like your buddy here? Come on. Take a good look. You think you're tougher than him? After we're done with you, we're gonna grind you up in one of these machines here. <laughs> it's it's just a question of whether I'm gonna be nice enough to fucking kill you first. <laughs> hey, what's that fucking stench? Oh! Hey! Hey, somebody's Drop. over there! Hey, who the fuck are you supposed to be? Jesus Christ, what what is Captain Shitbag here to save the day? Shut the fuck up, Luca. Hey! I know you. You're the chump who was hanging around with that moron, Barbaro. I thought you were still rotting in the can. What the fuck you think you're doing here? Falcone sent me. He isn't too fond of skinny little cocksuckers trying to turn his guys into mincemeat. So, you joined up with Falcone, huh? Well, I'll tell you what. If you knew what was really going on, you'd realize that you was better off in jail. But that don't matter now anyway. <laughs> Come on. Swing, buddy. Yeah. Swing for me. Oh. Come on. Come on. That's what we like to see. Right, come on. Balls has got you. And I got you. Hell yeah. You fuck with the wrong guys, assholes. Oh, for crying out loud. Will you get me down, please? Thanks, Vito. Unfortunately, I can't. It has to be Mr. Balls yeah, over here. He was a couple of guys shy at roll call. Shit. Poor Frankie. I'm gonna kill that son of a bitch. Beans, stay here and don't come out until we come get you. Okay, okay. Just don't forget about me. Okay, fellas? We won't. Don't you worry. Now I get a chance to use the MP40 that I got last time. <laughs> Yo! <laughs> oh, he had a shotgun. Shit. I'm gonna take that if you don't mind. Where was your shotgun, buddy? Hell yeah. The shotgun is stupid good in this game. Little cocksucker's gonna piss his pants. Right. Yeah, they are. Guess who's next? We have to push the crate. Come on, balls. Have the realization. Oh shit, we have to kill the guys first. Cover 
Come on. Oh, I missed. Where do you think you're going? You think you got the flank on us? Is that what you think? Is that what you think, boy? Clearly not, because he's not even there. Yo, that's a lot of people. No, 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 no. That is not what I am prepared for to happen. Oh, come on. Three more. Come on, poke the little noggin. Thank you, balls. Yo, balls, why are you shooting me? Yo, what? One more to go. One more. Come on, Asshole. Alright. Nice job. Now let's Hell get yeah. that little cocksucker. Yeah, not not. Before he makes any more fucking Come phone calls. On. Let me in. We gotta go get the crate, buddy. We gotta push the crate. Can I pick that up? Shit. I ain't gonna it, landed. It, like it landed. It landed in a way that you. Yeah, it looks like you like can pick that, it up. Like battering ram. I know. Like. We'll use that card. So fucking smart, huh? Go ahead, try. Son of a bitch. What's he doing over there? Ah, oh, yeah, no, no, Let God. me you fuck. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Now, you I'll fucking show you what it feels no, like. You know, no, no, God, no. fucking son of a bitch. I'm gonna have a little fun with Luca before I grind him up. Wanna join me? Uh, thanks for the invitation, but I think uh, I'll pass it. Uh, blood, huh? No, just hate the sight of Luca. I hear you, but you're missing out. I think I'm gonna try out that cattle prod he was. Uh, yeah, Eddie wanted me to take care of him personally. Don't worry about that. It'll just take a little longer this way. This fuck don't deserve a quick death. I can't argue with that. Okay, I'm gonna go. I stink like an outhouse. I gotta get cleaned up. And tell Lady he don't gotta worry about Luca. Yo, Beans, open the door. It's all over. You? You're still alive? Yeah. What'd you expect? Look, before we go home, you wanna give me a hand with Sleeping Beauty here? You know, that's not such a bad idea. You see, I always thought that ending left the game in a way that Luca Garino could have survived as if they worked together or something to I don't know save him in a way but obviously I mean it wouldn't make sense for the character of Mr. Balls and Mr. Beans but it does seem that way it definitely does but hey we got a swanky new car I am definitely keeping this one and now we are we're off to see Mr. Scarpa to tell him it's done. <laughs> the fucking bit of my tire just zoomed off. <laughs> Eddie, it's done. And he's going, oh God, oh God, oh God, oh Jesus Christ! Was that you? Vito? Oh Jesus, why didn't you take a fucking bath before you came back? You told me to come right back when I was done. You think I'm enjoying this? Okay, 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 what happened with Luca? It's done. All right, how about our guys? You find them? Yeah, Luca had him in the slaughterhouse. Frankie's dead, but balls and beans are fine. Luca was, uh... Interrogating them when I got there. Any witnesses? Well, except for a dozen or so whoa, of Luca's bodyguards, we ran back, into nobody. Back up, okay? It was rough, Eddie. Yeah, it sounds like it got pretty hairy. 
But hey, you pulled it off and you got out of there in one piece, right? So go get cleaned up before you ruin everybody's appetite. And burn those fucking clothes you're wearing. My God. But I don't want to burn my clothes. It's like my favorite outfit in the game. Besides Vito's original clothes. Eyes. Oh, but those hold no... Those aren't smart, so I can't wear them to like half the missions in the game. I only realized now that I was driving in the wrong direction. Let's get clean. <laughs> and we're back in the same suit. <laughs> Right, so the scene that follows this is actually my favourite scene in the game, and probably not for the reason you're thinking. I actually really enjoy the interaction between Vito and Leo Galante in this next scene, so keep an eye out for that. Something about it just feels so genuine, and it doesn't, doesn't even feel like you're playing a game. It just feels like two old friends who just casually happen to bump into each other, and it's really well done. Hey Vito, you made it. Hey Eddie. Oh, nice threads. Thanks. So, uh, what's the plan, fellas? What's with the suits? Vito, Mr. Falcone is gonna bring us into the family tonight. You and me, we're gonna be made. No oh, shit. Tonight? Yeah. Really? Why didn't you tell me before? What do we gotta do? You'll find out. But first, there's somebody who'd like to have a little word with you. Leo, good to see you. What are you doing here? <laughs> hey, kiddo. I want to talk to you about what's going to happen today. Come here, have a seat. All right. <sighs> sure. And hey, thanks again for doing whatever you did to get me out of the can early. You know, I made good on my second promise to you. Second promise? Yeah. I told you the next time we opened the books, we'd recommend you, didn't I? And now it's done. You had something to do with this, but you work for Frank Vinci. Yeah. I would have liked to have had you in our family, but I figure Joe there is your best friend. You guys grew up together, just like me and Frank. Since Joe was working for Carlo the whole time you were inside, I recommended they take you in too when he got made. Thanks, Leo. I, I don't know what to say. You don't gotta say nothing. Not to me or anybody else. That's kind of the way this whole thing works, Vito. <laughs> yeah. Now, come on. We don't want to keep him waiting. All right. I'll see you fellas upstairs. What was that all about? Nah, nothing. Just, you know, talking about old times. Like that time when old Leo dropped the soap. Fuck you. All right, all right, all right. That's enough. Let's go. These are like two school kids, I swear to God. All right, wait here. Now listen to me, fellas. It's one at a time. Once you're inside, just do as you're told, okay? Joe, come on in. Hey. Good luck. All right, your turn, Vito. Gentlemen, this is Vito Scaletta. Vito, know that this family of ours is a secret. You are entering the Society of the Chosen, a society which does not exist to the rest of the world. Our family means more to you from now on than your own family, or God, or your country. If I ask you to kill your own brother, you must do it. Show me. Which finger would pull the trigger? Repeat after me, Vito. If I were to betray the secret of our way of life... If I were to betray the secret of our way of life... May my soul burn in hell, just like this saint. May my soul burn in hell just like this saint. Amico Nostra. Gentlemen, I give you our new friend, Vito Scaletta.
I am very pleased to have these two talented and honest men join us. And I'm happy this has happened in the presence of our esteemed guests, especially Don Frank Vinci. And it's you might wonder why I'd take this risk again after spending almost seven years in a can. You see, where I grew up, the only guys who mattered were the guys who had the balls to take what they wanted. You will receive payment for your services from Eddie. Would you like to add anything, Frank? Whatever you do, gentlemen, stay away from the dope. No dope. That's our policy. You can make plenty of money. And after years of doing everybody else's dirty work, too many risks. I was willing to risk anything to finally be somebody. Right, so that was the perfect place to end off for today. Vito is a made man, and we have this beautiful little house of ours, which we will explore more in future videos. For now, that's just about all we have time for. I want to reiterate what I said at the start of the video once again. Thank you so much for all the support on the Mafia Definitive Edition gameplay trailer reaction. And in regards to today's video, thank you very much for watching. If you like the video, drop a like on the video. If you dislike the video, drop a dislike on the video. Thank you very much for watching once again, and I will see you in the next video. Tequila.